Hey guys, it's Seaside, and I wanted to give my thoughts on Sonic Superstars before the game releases on October 17th of this year. If you watched the trailer from Summer Games Fest earlier this month, uh, you would have saw that they brought back Fang, who hasn't really been in a Sonic game since Sonic the Fighters. And they're bringing back Amy too, which is also a really nice addition since the last mainline game that isn't Sonic Origins. She hasn't been really playable since Sonic 06, and in that game they really did not do her good, so it's really good to see her back in a mainline Sonic game, so yeah, that's pretty cool, I guess. The bonus that you get when you pre-order the game, or when you order the game or whatever, it looks uh, pretty nice. Uh, Lego Eggman is okay, I guess. I don't really see someone saying, Holy shit, we get Lego Eggman for pre-ordering the game. Oh my god, I need to buy like 40 copies of the game. But, eh, it's okay, I guess. The reversible cover looks like Sonic Mania promotional art, but I'm fine with that. The main box art looks fire anyways. But the display thing looks kinda cool though. Useless fact, but this game was called Sonic Onion with the Origins font, which is a pretty stupid ass name. I don't know why they would call a game Sonic Onion, unless they want people to cry, like in Sonic 06. But hey, at least you can play online with four people local co-op, so well, that's okay I guess. I don't really see who I'm gonna be playing this game with, except for myself, so okay I guess. Uh, the powers that they get from the Chaos Emeralds are an interesting concept, but until the game releases, I have nothing more to say. Also, my bad for it being kind of short because I didn't have nothing else to say. And this is my first review for, like, ever. I don't know. So, yeah. See you guys in the next video. Bye.